President Donald Trump and the head of the FDA are planning to ban flavored e-cigarettes amid an outbreak of serious lung illnesses and a surge in underage vaping. According to government studies, more than 80% of underage users say they picked e-cigarettes because of the flavors. Sarah Dolliff has that story. Sweet and fruity vaping flavors could soon be off shelves. President Donald Trump says his administration is moving to ban all non-tobacco flavors used in e-cigarettes. We can't allow people to get sick and we can't have our youth be so affected. It comes amid an outbreak of serious respiratory illnesses tied to vaping. At least six people have died and nearly 500 have fallen ill. The cases, both confirmed and under investigation, spread across 42 states. Many involving young, previously healthy people who'd viewed vaping as a safer alternative to traditional cigarettes, prompting lawmakers to push for action. Vaping is now the wild west of uh, the new nicotine addiction era. I think we have to ask ourselves, how do we keep our young people from being drawn into these products? The flavors that are sometimes advertised. Uh, I mean, I, some of the names are alarming. Uh, they're clearly focused on children. The FDA is now developing guidelines to remove the thousands of flavors used in e-cigarettes and will roll those out in the coming weeks, followed by a 30-day compliance period for retailers. At that point, all flavored e-cigarettes other than tobacco flavor would have to be removed from the market. And the FDA says if the ban prompts young people to begin using tobacco flavored e-cigarettes, similar action may follow. The FDA says manufacturers could apply to have their flavored products re-enter the market, but they'd have to prove that it is beneficial to the public.